your boy No Tats here for another video, man. Welcome to my new channel, No Tats Reacts. If y'all are new here, man, subscribe. We're gonna be jumping into this stuff, diving in. Uh, you know, there's no jumper, uh, there's no jumper world, man. We're gonna be checking out a lot of no jumper content. Uh, you know, video reaction, rap, music, everything. We gonna do it over here on this channel in English, man. So, you know, come on, follow me. I got another channel. Y'all see the plaque back there? I got another channel, man. But you know that's you know that's my French channel, so we're gonna do everything. Check it out. So I did the video on Blasey talking about his pay on uh, Ace Boy's uh, podcast. Now it looks like T Rail and Heather is talking about it in this video, so we're gonna check it out. See what's up, man. T Rail and Heather on Blasey's asking No Jumper for more money. They found it distasteful. Now I don't know if they found it distasteful because he asked for more money, or just or by the the way that he went about it. You know what I mean? Because you can ask for more money, you just got to do it behind the scenes, dog. But let's see what they had to say. As a business owner, I really don't like when my employees talk amongst each other about pay because everybody has a different background. They come in at a different level. Everybody's workload is different as well. And I just don't like that shit. That shit is petty to me. I don't like when people talk about it. But one thing I do notice about AD is that he always says that no jumper pays him very well and that he gets paid. You know, he just always... Uh, he flaunts that a lot. And so I'm telling Terrell, like, well, how much does AD get paid? Because do you match that pay and do you get paid the same amount? Because what Terrell came in as, I didn't agree with, and I told him to ask for more. But, you but Terrell like said, no, now. but you Terrell like said, but now. listen what I'm saying. Terrell said, uh, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna work there, whatever, like do my part, whatever. He's like, <clears throat> I have to, you know, get my foot in, you know, in the door or whatever. And then you can ask for a raise or whatever. Like that's very respectful. That's very nice of you. And Terrell has been doing that, um, you know, from then on when he got hired, what, almost two years ago or a year ago until now. And he's never asked for more. He's never complained. He's never asked everybody else what they get paid or this is this. So I just think it's distasteful to talk about the company that you work for and like just downplay them like they're not paying you enough like first of all maybe you should ask to see some numbers you bring in the numbers in you bring in that you know what i mean that's for sure now she said uh ad always you know he keep he basically he, he keep he keeps it diplomatic man he's not about to go against you know what I'm saying? say no nah, they ain't paying me or this and that the only time I seen AD raise his eyebrows is when Adam came out on the other podcast talking about he make a million a month. Then he was like, damn, hold on, what's going on? And then they was, you know what I'm saying? They had the old thing about the salary. That's Adam's fault, man. He should have got on there talking that stuff. Then everybody else talking about, well, what am I making? But he is the boss of No Jumper. He created No Jumper. So he, you know what I'm saying, his, how much he makes a month, how much they bring in. You know what I'm saying? He put in a lot of work. He has other uh, platforms that are helping that income. Now, when uh, Heather said that AD gets gets paid well, and she asked him, "Well, well, how much? Well, how much is AD getting paid?" She asked T Real, "How much is AD getting paid? Are you doing the same? Are you asking? Are you getting these numbers?" The thing you can't compare T Real to AD. AD does more at No Jumper than T Rail does, or he did at least even when he first started. I'm not now. I think he's still on. He might still be on the uh, No Jumper News, but AD was doing No Jumper News, Tuesday show, and the Wednesday show, and he got a food show. T Rail does Wednesday, and he does his interviews. That's not equal to what you know. What I'm saying AD does four things. T Real does too, so you gotta understand that they're not gonna get the same pay. They're not providing the same uh, input into the company as uh, one another. You know what I mean? So you gonna get paid based on what you bring to the company. And Blasi, on the other hand, is only on disconnected. And sometimes he's on interviews and stuff, but man, come on, dog. Like you gotta be serious, man. Like. You think you worth this and that and this, but what are you doing? Like she said, what are you bringing in the numbers? And that's for real. 
off, maybe you should ask to see some numbers. You bringing the numbers in? You bringing that? You know what I mean? I feel like if you do talk <laughs> yeah. about it, you need to go straight to the source. Go yeah. straight to or go straight to the source. Go straight to the source. Hey, bro. Ooh. But I don't think he has like a big part in No Jumper, right? Here goes one. I mean, he on disconnected. I mean, everybody probably feel like they uh, everybody pull feels it, pull it, put you know putting their work in and they're doing, bringing in money. Yeah, they doing their thing, but, but you know, you know I, I just feel like it's kind of like distasteful to go on a platform and say what you're doing and what you're not doing. I mean, because one, I just appreciate this shit. You feel yes, me? Yes, the it, opportunity, the opportunity, and what it brings. It, it's definitely. Um, it's definitely uplifting everything that you have. You feel me? You can see it all around you. Like there's positives. Yeah, look at what I'm doing with this nigga Smack. Smack yeah. is doing multiple interviews. There's Smack. learn. That's for sure. Now that's real talk. It ain't just about the financial that you're getting from no jumper. It's helping your brand, helping you your your, your personal brand as well. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure Vladdy has gained customers, or you know what I'm saying, in some way. Uh, shape or form, he's gained something from No Jumper besides the paycheck that they're giving him. You know what I mean? Just like T Real said, we're doing this podcast, doing this and doing that. You know what I'm saying? You're building your fan base, duh. And when you get some true fans that's willing to buy stuff from you and support you, man, that's important. In the long run, ain't about, okay, so what if they pay you uh, less than you pay your warehouse workers at the end of the day you're gonna gain more just from being on that platform in front of four million people bro like come on you gotta just be grateful man come on man a lot of people just be grateful man you know what i mean for what you got because a lot of people would like to be in that situation man you know I mean, even myself i'll be on disconnected man every every week bro you know what i'm saying pay me what the what you what the warehouse worker getting paid to be on disconnected because at the end of the day in a year from now man my brand will grow if i get on there now the, a year from now my brand will be bigger than what it is man you know what i mean somebody sometimes we just need that opportunity and but you know black act like he he need to get this and that man but you ain't doing this and that brother y'all already know man let me know what y'all think man comment section but i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video